What's up, what's up? This your boy JG back with another video on music tips and reviews with JG. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please press the subscribe button so you'll be updated on all my latest content. Uh, appreciate y'all for so always supporting me on my channel. Uh, Drake has come out with another random album. <laughs> Honestly, never mind. Came out, uh, I believe, last night. Uh, I heard it this evening uh, after I got myself situated and you know finally got to set, sit down, uh, take a little ride, and uh, listen to it. And uh, uh, a lot of people are talking about this album. They saying this is uh, a garbage album. It's trash. Uh, I don't know if he's trying to. He tried to push this album before Beyonce uh, dropped next month, uh, the 29th, uh, July 29th. I don't know if it was. You know, people have speculations on why. You know, he dropped the album uh, now. You know, randomly. Uh, maybe he had these songs in the vault. I don't know. Uh, I have mixed feelings about this album. Uh, I think it's it's decent. I, I like that you know each song kind of fits together. Uh, it's not like just songs put together. It's kind of like a, a thought process that he probably went through, you know, putting these songs together. But I think you know the Twenty One Savage song at the end. Uh, I think. Uh, Jimmy Cooks, I believe that's the name of the song. Uh, it didn't fit the rest of the album to me, but it was one of the best songs on the album. Uh, I think he was very strategic. He's a very strategic strategic artist, uh, kind of similar to the Kanye West, you know, the way he market, you know, his albums. Uh, I think he's very smart about uh, creating this album. I think it's going to appeal to the UK. Uh, you know, London uh, crowd, the London fans uh, that support Drake. So I, I think he's very strategic about, you know, what he put on the album. Uh, I think 14, 15 songs on this album. Uh, very popish. He didn't do a lot of rapping on this album. Only on the one with uh, 21 Savage. You know, he really uh, rapped on the album. Uh but uh, let me know what y'all thought about the album. I thought it was pretty decent. Um, I think, uh, you know, he just put out something. Uh, y'all know he, uh, if you heard, you know, he got a big deal from Universal. So, like, if you know, <laughs> if I do the same thing if I was him, I'd just drop albums when I want to. You know, just drop them back to back. And, uh, yeah, I, I just dropped them like that. I think he's so versatile. Uh, as far as his music is concerned, um, that he can drop, you know, any kind of song, you know, pops, pop album, hardcore rap, um, mainstream, you know, and it kind of, you know, brought me back to when he did the album Take Care. It's kind of in that that lane where, you know, most of the album he's, you know, singing instead of rapping. And uh, I feel people shouldn't judge him because of that, you know. If you want to sing on the album, let him sing. You know, he already has, has you know, the fame. He already has a lot of fans. And, uh, you know, why not? You know, if you feel like singing, go ahead and let him sing on the album. You know, I heard a lot of stuff. You know, he, he's singing. You know, a lot of people was against that. But, you know, he just dropped the album before this. Uh, he was rapping most of the album. And so, you know. If he, he, you know, he felt like saying, you know, singing on this album, so be it. So, uh, but I, I like the album. It won't bad. I don't think it's a trash album. Uh, I, I definitely, you know, ride this out, you know, if I'm driving or just cruising. Uh, and it kind of feel like he's always been kind of influenced by Sade as well. You know, his mel melodic uh, choices, his note choices. And uh, I heard a little runs, you know, in this album. I was like, okay, he 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 really got some singing skills, you know. And I was thinking, compared to Kanye, you know, Kanye is not the best singer, but uh, Drake, you know, he has a decent voice. 
as far as singing so uh i can't knock nothing about this album uh i think like i said it's very strategic i think he's very smart he, he planned it out you know the way he wanted to drop this album and people you know even though people said it's trash they still <laughs> you know drake is drake and they still want to listen to the album so uh yeah i, I think it was pretty good uh I like the way it has a, a, a certain feel. He loved that uh, that kind of Caribbean island vibe, you know, uh, drum beats on his albums, but simple. Um, a lot of a lot of the uh, the songs on the album had a, a loop feel to it, you know, as far as the beats is concerned. I want a lot of huge production on this album, but uh, yeah, I think he just felt in that creative vibe, you know, just kind of like an improv type you know album so uh this been my review of drake honestly never mind album uh, put your comments below what you thought about the album i won't gonna go track for track because uh, of me that was kind of the downfall of this album a lot of the songs did sound the same i i'll say but uh i like that you, you know the whole album had a certain uh, connection each song had a connection to the next and so yeah this has been another video and review from your boy jg all right peace